information is this is strictly for us. It's not for everybody. It's just what we use in-house. So I know a lot of people probably use a lot of different terms and things of that nature, but this is what we do inside of our building. So I enlisted the help of one of my superstar national level competitors, Miss KD, Candy Girl, Candice Delberto. All right, so one of the first things you want to do is when you, before you go out on stage, you want to get your nice stretch. Here, make sure your chest is tall, elongate the abs, and I want you to watch Candace walk. As she walks out, she's going to watch the judges, and she's going to go ahead and get to the relaxed pose here as we get on the next. A little bit of a different walk in Coco's. That's the setup. Excellent. One more time. Go back and do that again for me, Candace. I want you to watch Candace set up. Watch how she just didn't go right here into the relaxed position. As you saw what Coco did earlier, she gave me a nice little setup. Just a little sass, add a little sass on, and then we're here. Once again, here we go. She's walking out, making eye contact with the judges. There we go. Set up, and here we go. Now, as you can notice, Candace is pushing her hips back. She's setting her hips back, squeezing down on her quads. Her knees are actually slightly bent. I know you can't tell, but they're slightly bent. You're good, Candace. That way, you're showing the separation, a little bit of separation in the quad. She has her chest pulled tall, as if I got it on the string here. The taller she has her chest, the smaller her waistline looks. She has her lats out. She has her arms casing her lats. Notice her arms ain't all the way here. And she don't look like she's struggling. She's very relaxed in her posing. That way you can see the roundness of the shoulder matching the quad sweep as well. Now, this is what is called the relaxed pose, guys. So lats out, arms casing out. Give me the other command is gonna be quarter turn to the right. Candy girl, give me quarter turn to the right. Here we go. As you can see how she's flowing like water, it's Effortlessly. You know she's not like straining here to pose. It's just relaxed here. So you can see she can stick her pinky finger out and here be right in her hip pocket here. Excellent. And relax. So she's tight up top, but she's loose from the elbow down. The other arm, like we talked about before, is splitting her body here and she's leaning into it. So if you were to have your other arm here, it's not like you don't have another arm. So you want to extend it as Candy is doing. The other thing is, one thing that my brother Ben likes, I talk about just to show a little bit more of that leg definition, is the pinky toe here. So I have her actually pushing through her pinky toe just a little bit to show a little bit more definition in, in the legs. Quarter turn to the right. Ladies, always remember to remove your hair that way the judges can see your back. As you can see here, once again, Candy is pushing her hips back to give the illusion of round glutes, but also give you a little bit more definition in the hamstrings. So Candy, go ahead and relax for a second without pushing your hips back. So that's Candice regular. Go ahead and put it in 3D. That's Candice in 3D, pushing from the hips here. Push it from the lower back, so you should feel a little pain in the lower back, as well as lats out, showing rear delts, nice and easy. Go ahead and take your pinky toes out slightly. That way we can see a little bit of the quad sweep from the rear. So that's why you put your pinky toes out a little bit. Give me a quarter turn to the right. Once again, this is the opposite side pose. Once again, Candace is not struggling when she's posing. She's nice and relaxed and she's flowing like water. You notice she's not here, and even from the front pose, she's not here. Once again, here we are, bring that elbow out just a little bit. Excellent. Now what I want you to do is breathe in through your nose and blow out through your teeth. There we go. Once again, push it through the pinky toe. Give me a quarter turn to the right. And once again, look how relaxed she is in that front pose, the relaxed position. So now we have all of our mandatories, our quarter turns to the right. Now we're going to show you a model pose. So earlier Coco showed you the model pose with her leg stiff. Candace likes to have her leg bent as well and as well as straight. Go ahead, show me a model pose. Your choice, Miss Candace. As you can see here, go ahead and bring this foot up a little bit close to the big toe. That way you can really lock that back. How'd that feel there? Yeah. Nice. So you hear the lat is out. Your arm is kind of hanging right over top of your lap. Once again, I'm going to show you guys this. Candace, keep your legs just like this. I want you to turn your upper body towards the window here. And I want you to relax. Go ahead and get it. Uh, open up your lats for me. Now, her lats are open. The easiest way to do it is now all she's going to do is just keep her lats open and she's going to turn. As she's turning, she's putting this hand on the hip, keeping the lat out to here. Easiest way to do it. So you get your lat out and then you just rotate around. Candace is keeping tight. As you can see, go ahead and get up on that hip just a little bit. Excellent. She's raising her hip slightly. Now, Candace, show me that same pose, but I want you to have your leg bent there in the front. There we go. So that's the other model pose with the leg bent. So Candace is actually pushing through the balls of her feet here. That way she can kind of show a little bit of definition in the legs. Okay, give me the opposite side model pose, champ. Step, one, two, and drag. Excellent, bring that elbow forward a little bit, Candace. There we go. Excellent. Very nice, perfect. And these are gonna be your model poses. 
and relax, Miss Kansas. So the other pose I want to show you guys is when you guys are waiting for a call out while always another lineup on stage, there's certain procedures that you need to run through while you're standing off to the side waiting for your call out. So what we're going to do is we're going to walk over here. Candace is going to demonstrate for us. As you're leaving the judges, make sure you're always watching with your eyes. And Candace is going to come over and line up off to the side. Remember, your number is always on your left side. So like Candace's number is on her shorts, this is actually how it's going to look. And she'll be off to the side watching the judges here waiting for her call out. Candace, can you do this one for me as well? That side pose here? There we go. And there's the other one there as well. Standing off to the side with your leg bent. And you can just go right here with it. Excellent. Excellent. All right, so that has been another demonstration of our figure division poses. Once again, I'm going to go through them one more time. Go ahead and show me a front pose, Miss Candace. Nice. Show me a model pose. Excellent. And turn, face the rear of the stage. She's turning, removing the hair, pushing from the lower back, lats open, and give me a step back drag. Step back, pivot. Hello. Jay's Fit Factory, Muscle Swag Nation, stand up. See you guys at the top. Candace D, JJ Henry.